solving people's problems, right? Don't get all bent out of shape. Besides, I'll always be older than you. Whatever. Well, what's the problem? Uh, you see, Mr. Birdie ran away and hasn't come back. Oh! Mr. Birdie is a bird friend of ours. His head is all pointy. Kind of like yours, mister. Pointy, huh? I bet they're talking about Cloud Jr. Who's that? Your bird friend. He had a run-in with a nasty fiend, and we saved his tiny behind. No way! You guys, Grandpa said he saw Mr. Birdie heading toward the desert. What? But we aren't allowed to go all the way out there. You just leave it to us. We'll find your friend. Really? Promise. Great. Grandpa said there's some old bird houses out in the desert that people built back in the Republic days. He said those are good places to set traps. Oh, and my mommy told me you can craft them yourself if you've got the right chip. Don't you worry. We'll get those bird traps ready in no time, won't we? All right, then. Let's go find our bird, buddy. He'll definitely be happy to see you. At least somebody will be. I understand there's no making amends for how I did these people wrong, but I want to help. I need to help. What happened with the reactor wasn't your fault, you know? I could have told you that. No, I ain't the one who proposed building the damn thing. That was Shinra. Just hitched my wagon to it. Right. It took a while to accept that, though. Hell. I did everything in my power to avoid thinking about it at all. Eventually, I realized the excuses I was clinging to weren't making me feel any better. What happened in Corral, that's my burden to bear. <laughs> Just don't go breaking your back. Yeah, well, it's stronger than you think. I won't pretend it's all for the kids. End of the day, I'm doing this for me. Life was a hell of a lot simpler back in old Midgar. 
We were good, Shinra was bad, and if we took him out, the world would be all right. So what's changed? Not a damn thing. Shinra's still going down, but coming back here, I see how I got top of it. And not because Shinra was all I had to think about, it's because I didn't want to think about anything else. Saving the planet's important, but I put a lot of personal stuff on the back burner, and I shouldn't have. I and the others helped give me that clarity. Just wish I could have got it sooner. You'll find this hard to believe, but I've actually changed quite a bit since my younger days. Uh oh Thanks to Tifa, mostly. She really set me straight. Especially as a parent. Wouldn't be half the father I am today without her. That's so. What'd she do? Oh, got fed up with my bullshit and tore me a new one. Started yelling about how a kid like Marlene needed a proper roof over her head. Somewhere safe and clean. Said sleeping outside was risky. She was right. Sure was. And not just her. The whole team helped me get my act together. I used to be a runaway train, charging full speed ahead and dragging folks along for the ride. Never thought about hitting the brakes or anything else. Had my fair share of crashes and went off the rails a few times. Caused a lot of trouble for those guys. Well, I'd say you managed to get yourself back on track. I couldn't have done it without them. They came into my life for a reason. Like you did, Cloud. Junior, too. I know it in my heart. caught one of the others. Only one way to find out.
Found our boy. Look. Let's move. Too bad. Let's do that. Yeah. 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 
Scared, Junior. Thought you were gonna wind up Monster Child. Oh, is that your way of saying you're good on your own? But go straight home, you hear me? We said, your friends are looking for you. You head straight home. <laughs> no wonder. Thank you so much. Hey, just doing a job. Go on, eat up. Someday you're going to be big and strong and scare away all the monsters. Hope I can bring Marlene back here one day. Tell her about her home and everything else. Uh, you sure that's a good idea? I owe it to her father. You'll feel better, maybe, but how do you think she'll feel? Don't know, man. <sighs> What's up? My dad says we're supposed to stay away from you. Sorry. That's so. <laughs> well, don't want to get you in trouble. Us old fellas gotta go. Take care of Cloud Jr. Thanks again for all your help, mister! Don't mention it. <laughs> 